Hey guys, Paulie Howard. I'm with Fox Sports Radio for the card Friday, February 10th. Before I tell you what I'm betting, Dime Durant run. Ooh, the shenanigans last night in the Cleveland OKC game. Uh, Cavs open minus two at Bookmaker on Wednesday. They bet OKC to one and a half before the Cavs tipped off against Indiana Wednesday night. Lou made the comments of LeBron, LeBron plays major minutes. He won't play. He played 38 minutes. Bookmakers open OKC 4 first thing Thursday morning at 6.20 Pacific because after the, the Indiana game, Lou said the big three, all of them were out. Ten minutes later, it's OKC 7. Then it's 8. By 7 in the morning, it's 9. By 8 in the morning Pacific, it's 10. It went as high as 12, back down to 11.5. They take it off the board. It reopens at 3.40 Pacific. Cavs minus 1.5. Close Thunder minus one, and then they're up 12 with 20 seconds. So everything, all the bet, late tickets, everything. And Jones hits a three for the Cavs, and they, they win by nine. But, oh, a bloodbath for the books. I can't remember where that's happened, where a coach changes his mind. He usually does it the other way. But to say the night before the big three are out, and then that late in the game, you know, like 340 Pacific, oh, they're all going to play now, and all hell breaks loose, and you have an 11-point move. And then it goes back. Oh, unbelievable. It's hard to bet this stuff unless right before tip when you know who's in, who's out. Look at this Nuggets game tonight against the Knicks. Moody, A. Gallinari, and Fareed supposed to miss. But, you know, and sometimes they won't let you know till before the game or an hour before the game as well. Horrific beat if you had the Jazz. They're up 21 points with six minutes left in the third quarter. They blow it against Dallas on the road. They're up four with 20 seconds. It goes to overtime. Dallas wins 112 to 105. Harrison Barnes had 31 in that one. A horrible job by Utah. They're also the slowest team in the league in terms of pace, and they still spit it up. The college games lived up to the hype. Terrific doubleheader on ESPN. Duke, North Carolina, and UCLA and Oregon. UCLA closed four, 163. Everything came down to the final possession. Tough beat if you had the over. As Oregon couldn't do much in the second half. Huge win for UCLA, down 19 in that game. Ball took over late. The big three getting in the basket. Big miss free throw on the front end of a one and one. UCLA could have sent it over and cashed the ticket with that. Uh, Duke closed two and a half, 164. Both games side and total down to the last possession. That's what we want. That's what we like to see. And St. Mary's and Gonzaga coming up Saturday. Looking forward to that as well. Thanks to a uh, good job by Tony Miller at the Golden Nugget, top man here. Vegas at the Golden Nugget. He put up the prop Cubs against the field. Yes, no. Will the Cubs win the World Series? No minus $5. Yes, plus $350. And he opens the Cubs win total at 97 and a half. Good job by Tony Miller. It's always Cubs money, but they're going to get an avalanche of Cubs money as they go for the repeat. Good job there from Tony. Time to tell you what I'm betting. A couple of big, fe big featured pro picks over my shoulder and up at pregame. We got uh, Koken and Dave Esser with three stars in the NBA tonight. Big slate in the NBA. Get on board with those two guys and uh, keep it going, Uncle Dave, as well. We have a total in the NBA that goes tonight, a 12-4 and four run. Let's keep it going. Let's see if we get a good tempo and a high-scoring game. Teams uh, with some rest, are rested, rather, in this one. Handicapping the cappers, not my pick. Paulie's pick from the pros. Let's make it 13-4 and four run with the NBA total. As always, betting half a unit on the free play. Hold your nose and take the Knicks. Yes, no Gallinari, no Moutier. And supposedly no Farid, so, you know, at some point they got to get a win, right? They blow a 10-point fourth-quarter lead against the Clippers. Maybe the Knicks show me something today. Take the Knicks minus two at home against the Nuggets for the free play. Big show coming up Friday with Brad Powers and Dave Malinsky. Gonzaga, St. Mary's, SMU, Cincinnati. Recap what happened last night. Talk about the Cubs prop and a little NFL as well. It's uh, usually up less than an hour after the show, and it airs live 10 a.m. Pacific here in Vegas. I've ranted, now I'm going to run. Good luck out there. We'll talk to you Saturday on pregame.com.